Hi, I'm Kyler, and you're watching The Three Scared Men. Fuck, 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 fuck! You're right. Anyway. <laughs> All right. So concept. I've just saved, which leaves me, which leaves me with an in, in, in unstoppable amount of confidence. In Hello, sir. What do I need to know today? I need to know. Oh, so I was just wondering if I could like get a free kill on him since he's distracted. Oh, I forgot that they do that. I was talking about me. Okay. Well, um, I'm just gonna. My grandfather. I was out. I was a. Uh, I was helping refinish his deck uh, a few days ago. Uh, and he was out there with me for, for for a small spell, but he's old, so he was staying inside mostly. And he got up after that and walked away, and his entire back, from neck to the bottom of his shorts, was completely soaked through. Just a, uh, it was like the front half of him was dry, and the back half where was just drenched. Oh. It was really fucking nice. funny. I don't he know how to, to get the there. Goddamn chair after being <laughs> out in like 98 degree heat. Uh, thanks, thanks, Zach. Ah, oh, hi, hi. Yep. Okay, hi. I'm gonna go up here. Just go back the way you came. Easy for you to say. If the alien was a D and D monster, what category would it be? Fiend? Uh, Monstrosity. Yeah. It wouldn't be anything out of out, out of the. Uh... Would it be an aberration? No, it'd be it'd be monstrosity. I think I don't think it's anything. Well, I don't think I've been in here. Monstrosity considered. Um, anything that's like super <coughs> natural. I don't think it's unnatural because it is in biology. Is kind of, but like it's fucking whack, but it's still you're fucking whack. It's really more of a parasite. Yeah. Ooh, so what's this? Like, oh, it's not like a beast. Well, it's not. A, I, oh, I think come on. I think it's an aberration because it's alien. Oh, whatever. It, it's not. It's nothing like. It's nothing from a different plane. It's. It's definitely of this world. It's just yeah. so fucking whack. I think yeah. Monster Aberration is the right It's a... No, it was definitely above me there. Are you Yeah, it was coming into that room that I was in. Well, whatever. That's, I'm sure it's fine. I'm sure it's... Okay, that's not fine. Best part about it is I couldn't tell whether that noise was the alien. Yeah, I couldn't either. Ah, mwah, mwah. Good design. Put please let me in touch, here, please. Put, down, put the put the item away. I, that's what not how that works. Oh, I don't know that. It's just. Hi. <sighs> Hi. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it went off. <laughs> I don't know why that fucking vent is so finicky. Sometimes he's not a violent person. <laughs> Me walking around with my flamethrower and casually walking up to that guy to see if I just could kill him. A flamethrower on one hand, a wrench in the other. I mean, you could just run for it for shits and goons. I'm kind of sad this game's finale isn't just... You're right. You walking through the nest with a pulse rifle and a flamethrower taped together. I know you do get to go through a nest with a flamethrower. Oh, yeah, I know that. that that's coming but up. That's not I, the know, I know that part. Can you not like Let me holster? In. Can you not just have bare hands out? Can no. you just holster out? No. Let me yeah. sure you can Let me go in. Yes, I've done it before. What's the but jump? It's button? really fit. There's not. Every game should have a double jump. I agree with that. Especially just, Tetris. Why won't? Oh, what? Wait. There we go. First it's try. It's so finicky, and only on that one. Like the other versions of this vent, I can get into. Okay, we spent thousands of dollars developing the AI for this game. How are entering vents? <laughs> well, most of the vents are fine, just not these shapes. In terms ones. of entering vents, we have none. <laughs> <laughs> we have no vents. I want to make a Guru character for Despicable Me, and I want to make awful Guru puns the entire time. And you want to make a Guru character for Despicable Me? <laughs> I mean, yes. Yes. When there's two... Hi, welcome to my uh, Despicable well, hi there. slash fiction. Despicable D. Alright. <laughs> Concept. Nate, that is, that is genuinely funny. Thank you. Concept. <laughs> I throw a flare here, and then go this way. The world's 
biggest brain. At you! That actually got me more than the end of the game. I was so immersed in this game that I thought it was going to come running at you because you fucking sneezed. I too. Bum, 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 bum. I was waiting for. I want a horror game that listens to your mic. There Wait, was, I think there was one of those. The Silent Hill PT. No, it no. did. It, no, it listened. You had to speak into it to beat the fucking thing at a certain point. I don't think. I think you're mixing up two indie games. I might be, but I remember something about the Silent Hill PT. There was some part where you I know that there was, there, at some mic. point there was an indie game that uh, mm -hmm. listened to you at all times. That's fucking nice. I hate it. I would, I would just love a horror, uh, like a fully fledged horror game like this. That, like, it's not a main oh, mechanic of the game, but it can hear you. Yeah. <laughs> you, you, you impressed or something? I was fucking crunching down on the sucker and holding really a full conversation. I can multitask, but the only thing I'm good at is shitty jokes and eating. It's not through here, is it? So, <laughs> as long as those two <laughs> things. Uh, <laughs> Just right those behind two me. things. You turn invisible, and you can shock people. Hi. That's fine. Well, it's fine. Why didn't you even try? Get good. Because I literally just saved. Oh, well. <laughs> Why spend resources if I can respawn two feet away from where I was? And that wasn't going the right direction anyway. It's definitely not through that door. Here's something Why did you say that? Because I have a map. Where does the alien there, get here. materials to build itself? Because it alien. goes from like a face hugger to a chest burster to a fully fledged alien real quick. I have no idea. Oh, this is this so, is it. This is this is the chapter in. Huzzah! Something. What is Project KG three four eight? I don't remember what I'm doing. We were trying to. Trap the alien, an then elevator? that went horribly. And now I don't yeah. know what we're doing. <laughs> well, the, so, the sound of combat can summon the alien. Keep that in mind. <sighs> yeah, that happened earlier when That'll I was fighting That'll be important on the pop quiz later. later. Uh, no. Uh, wait, your last plan nearly got me killed several times. What do you think, how do you think nearly. Solid Snake would fare against the alien? I hate this. I mean, he wouldn't be able to face it all into your dummy thick. <laughs> he do be dummy thick though. Where am I going? Who the Gary Fox knows? Oh hi! Oh god, it's found me. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Hello, sir. Looks like you had a lot of fun. It looks like Ah, that. that's a nice hole in your chest. Mmm, round. I'll give it an eight point five out of ten. I think there are a few. Yes. How much of dick in that? You lack an adventurous spirit, my good sir. And also you have um Decency. So. I'm gonna yeah, go. I'm gonna go back to my old uh, uh, vaping method of uh, being. I, uh, I have the will not to be more of surviving. Than CDC. Hey, who do you think condoms are for? I, I, I read them twice. I was trying to stick it to the chest hole. I'm gonna unsay everything. I'm gonna unsay uh, yeah, the I hate last everything about that. Hours. Sorry about that. <laughs> you ever heard of double speak? Yeah, I'm gonna do that with my thoughts. Ooh, flamethrower fuel. You think it'd be uncouth if I shoved a diaphragm in a dead body? There's actually just flamethrower fuel right there. there. It's almost like I was meant to be using my flamethrower a lot in the last like area. In the chest hole. Where is it, was it, was it their it. diaphragm to begin with? Because, I mean, you're just repairing it. Surgeon Simulator. Surgeon Simulator. Shut the fuck up. You never played Pro Surgeon Simulator. Chest cavity. Or contraceptive, whatever it's considered. Contraceptive. <laughs> Unbaby drug. <laughs> Hacker man. I'm a hack man. <laughs> Is this what it's like talking to me all the time? Yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm glad. I'm glad that I had some way to feel what? that. It just takes you somewhere else. The Loran system lobby. There's another door. Do I want to go that way? Apparently not. I don't even know. Why was I able to do that? That's really weird. And there's another elevator to a different place. Wacky. Hey, Project KG348. That's very loud. That's the place where you're supposed to go. Oh my god. Oh my god. 
God, I wish that were me. God, I wish what that is this music? Wow, it's almost like it was drawn in by that extremely loud sound. I thought it was playing Foreigner for a second. I think my favorite part of the Alien universe is that they're transporting these like supplies over hundreds of years of distance and going through like this super expensive cryo sleep and all this incredibly expensive equipment, but they still get paid fucking minimum wage. Like to travel across the galaxy for like hundreds of years in cryo sleep to like lose their friends and family and everyone they've ever known and cared about to the sands of time, and they just get paid fucking minimum wage. Does it really take hundreds of years? Yeah, because they have to go into cryo sleep because of the distance. Huh. Like legit. It oh, takes you were fucked. Vast amounts of time. This guy was fucked. This is why we have bandy gates. Yeah, fuck. You can leave station by the time you ever get back. Everyone you know is gonna. Like, and you still get minimum wage, just like real life. Well, then you tell me if the watch. Best part about it. Do you think? Do you think like spouse, spouses of those who go on the on missions like this, like go into cryo sleep themselves, so that they can still be around whenever their loved that one gets back? Be, that could also be part of it too. Which Alternatively, be really interesting. At this point, marriage is an outdated concept. Well, uh, yeah. it's also possible. Well, wait a minute, Tony. One on one on it. Marriage is for fucking hippies. You dude. can't work for the company. And why is there a golden ladder? I don't know. This what, uh, the, the none of the other ones have been what colored gold. What ass section of the ship are we in? <laughs> We're about I'm, I'm waiting for like purple. Oh my god! That is a bougie ass ladder. Right I said there. I'm waiting for purple lighting, and it started. To begin. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh like, are we about to go on a oh, spacewalk? Oh buddy! I don't want to do that. Oh, here we go. Get ready. Cool. I put a spacesuit on. I would not be without a spacesuit. No. Yeah, I think I have to What? What? I don't like that. What happened to you? You're goddamn right about the Alfredo. Would you look at it? Look at it. Look at All it. Right. That's straight out of Olive Garden. <laughs> <laughs> I want to make a straight out of Compton cover about Chad Alfredo. <laughs> See, the jokes I make aren't funny, but I make a lot of them, so eventually... You got a sharp nose, like Comedian. <laughs> okay, what am I doing in here? Uh, well, that's not helpful. It says restore power to the lab. Yeah, I know, but it's just this huge fucking ring. Well, it's within that ring. Thanks! This that is ring is this entire area. Right in time, Zach. Oh. Is this that area that you were in earlier where you had to go around I've not been this here. This is a brand new area. I've not been here okay. it, just, it was reminisce because you'd look up and in the last day they were working, Joe was wandering around. So. Where am I? Right that was not a circular room. Well, neither is this one. It is more circular than the other one. You're exactly right. This is a really big area, actually. It's <laughs> oh, crap off. Nate, how do you feel that milk is squeezed out of a cow tit? Like, what's your opinion on that? Like, have you ever just sat down and thought, man, I could really use some cow tit juice right now? I drank out of my mom's tit for about four years, so. That, that, mm, mm. Yeah, I've had worse. Hello. Overall, I'll give it like a three out of ten, you know. I'd rather have cow's milk than human milk, which seems weird. I have been using way much, way more flamethrower ammo than I needed to. I've learned that. It's a grudge. Now that it's gone. Yep, that's game design. They wanted you to rely on it a lot because they wanted to. Well, no, no. What I'm saying is that I've learned that I I was using more than I needed to. Mm. Gotcha. It's you optimized. We told you that. And you're like, ah. he's being really aggressive right now. Guys, idea. We get as angry as possible at Kyler for playing the game to his best visibility, and then we shoot ourselves. Actually, scratch that last part. Kyler, I feel like it's. Oh, he actually knows that this is the flamethrower. Like, did you see yeah, how he, he stopped he approaching charge. me? That time he just tackled me. 
Or maybe I, maybe I was so between it and Kyler, the exit. It might be really aggressive because you keep just letting it know you're here. What what am I supposed to do? Hide. Uh, not. I'm not gonna hide this Why? entire game. I mean, you did see. I like, have to make progress at some point. When he was hiding, it did take like five minutes for the alien to fucking go away. That's like, fair. But that's what the game's designed to be. Yeah, in the you other section, this center. section is made for the flamethrower. That's the whole point. That's right. Yeah, the I central. We're out of yeah. the flamethrower section. All the hidey runny sections are the pussies. Oh, so now we have the fire so chucker. Now we have the napalm water we gun. Have, we have the flammenwerfer. The flammenwerfer. It was flammen. Hans. Hans. How is the baddies? How is the baddies? Where'd that go? He did for Yes, I did. He did. He was the noise man. Where the fuck it went. I threw it down the hallway. I just didn't yeah, see it. Look at that yellow flashy thing. What? What? Okay, never mind. You know, the big red the thing. Big that, you know, you could, that looks important. Hello, big chungus. Are you, you in here? Well, you're alive. I can't do anything about it. I just need to not walk over him. Yeah, no, turn, turn to your right. God damn it. <laughs> there's, a, there's an emergency. Yeah, hang on, I see that. I, need... hit the, I think this is an emergency. Uh, I'm not positive, but I think things have gone a little off. Tyler, it hurt bad. It hurt bad. Always getting angry. It, it's never come in here after me. I don't think it's going to. Well, that's a bold statement. I know, I know. That's but... a bold statement for a scared man. Oh, oh, oh God! <laughs> <laughs> That's probably the most legit reaction I've had in this game. Oh, I just was not expecting that at all. It actually kind of got me too. Like, well, it's funny as it didn't come down the vent I went in. It went somewhere else to get to me. <laughs> me on my way. Oh my God. Me on my way to find the leftover ragu. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Uh, you got any pesto? <laughs> uh, hey, look at this. Pesto's <laughs> well, expensive. Yeah. <laughs> I'm also made of Wego's I still don't know what I'm supposed to do in that area. You're we supposed to turn off power. Well, I know. I don't. I didn't like, see any way to do like that. Bougie shit. No, it was just real the cheapest shit I could buy. Pesto is um. That's like an herb, right? Pesto's pesto is great. Pesto is a blend of basil, olive oil, parmesan, and pine nuts. I believe. It's, yes, that's it. Huh. It's very good. I believe it's those four. You can. You it's can great on chicken food. and noodles. Well, you can grow. You can grow the regular herbs yourself. Yeah, you can grow basil. Basil, basil's like the primary ingredient. Something I'm afraid that if I start going down, I'm gonna like live my. I'm gonna build my entire life around as like cottage core. That looks like a joke. I was like, <laughs> I was like, I could just. Go oh hey, to the, cottage just, core. That's so what's stupid. Up, dude? I love it. I love so that he's man. he's not having a good time. <laughs> Does the flamethrower work? <laughs> Oh my god, he's a sim. Alright. How are you enjoying Sebastopol? Um. Oh, let's see. Uh, Alright. <laughs> Clark is gone. Okay. Well, I see no point to have him come in here. Uh, ooh, you have stuff I can I have an explosive. Catch. Ooh, a stun baton charge. That's very nice. Concept. We make a game called Alan Isolation, where it's just a dude named Alan, and you're just running from him. There's not even like he's any... just he's just trying to like return your wallet or something. It's just like a game of tag, and you're really got bad you at it. right where I want you. I'd like to buy other chocolate. <laughs> 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 the music like swells up. He's like, I love it. No, it's it's Jehovah's Witnesses. My stepfather was Jehovah's Witness. I'm oh, so sorry. Is this Clark? Oh yeah, he hates it. I think that's Clark. I got a uh, key his card. Father oh, hi, Clark. His father Ooh, flamethrower fuel. Pulled him out of school oh, hi, Clark. Around sophomore year to focus on being a Jehovah's Witness. Hmm. He didn't get a choice in that matter. He missed the last two years of high school because his Who? dad forced him to Who was that? Witness. My father. My stepfather. Oof. Yeah. Attend the tale of big old yike. You know what the fuck was it? His stepdad, or his, his dad, years later, in fact, only a few years ago, realized his religion was bullshit. And didn't tell him to his face because that's of course what you did to him. You ruined his like childhood because of it, and now you're like, eh, it's crap. 
Oh, Oof. That whole side of the family is a bunch of fun. Don't top worry. ten plot twists, number one. <laughs> Hi, today we're counting down the top zero country songs. I hate you. <laughs> Hey, look, Michael wasted my like a full minute of my life uh, you between recordings. You didn't even watch the full video. Yeah, it was less it. than a minute. You watched like thirty seconds. You're like, wow, not comedian take Michael. Oh, it's all of about forty five seconds, and honestly, I appreciate it. It was really funny. I thought, but you didn't even get the joke. Well, it was like, funny, except I I already knew the joke three seconds into the video. It's fine, dude. Whether you're waving a Confederate flag at a NASCAR rally or saying the N-word in your grandma's basement, we've got you covered. Here are some finger-licking, uh, country-flicking country tunes. Finger-licking, bean-flicking country tunes. I said that with about as much intelligence as every person in Kentucky combined, so... Hey, cool. hey, I have a friend in Kentucky, and I can tell you that's exactly right. <laughs> Toph doesn't count, okay? Toph doesn't count. Kira, if you're watching this, I'm sorry. She's not. No, no way. Who? Someone watching our videos? Nah. Unless I, unless I actually like. Show Hi, Donovan. Kira. She's not gonna. Okay. Hi, Donovan. Still doesn't watch Why do you keep saying Donovan? Donovan? Is he like the only person who actively watches? Donovan's our fan base. That's yes. how we're well, our fan yeah, base. Yeah, Donovan's That's the only one that like watches a lot of our videos I consistently. See. So we call him. We call our fan base Donovan. If we'll ever have one. <laughs> we call Donovan Donovan because that's his name. Anyway. We're going to call people Donovan in the next episode. Bye-bye. Oh, 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 oh. We're going to feel it. I'm humble. You're in love with me.